At long last, the wait is over. A warm welcome to Wembley. This is Derek Ray, joined on the commentary box by Stuart Robson, and we're approaching kickoff time in what promises to be a spectacular FA Cup final. It's Aston Villa taking on Liverpool. Well, Derek, as a youngster growing up, this was the day that every young footballer dreamt of. Playing in the FA Cup final, walking out in front of 100,000 fans at Wembley, broadcast around the world, it still brings a tingle to my spine. And I'm really looking forward to this one. Explosive attacking qualities can be so important, look no further than Mo Salah. Well, he's their top marksman, but he's also a great all-round player. He just has that ability to go past defenders with such ease. Hopefully we see that again today. Here's how the lineup looks for Aston Villa. Well, it'll be interesting to see how the wingers play today. Will they stay high and wide? Will they come in field and support the centre forward? And how deep will they come out of possession? They're going to be key to this formation. Let's take a look at the Liverpool starting 11. Thank you. Enjoy the game. El Ghazi, and what a magical save it was! <laughs> Bailey, in possession to give them the lead, maybe. The opening goal in the final! And how important could that be? direction pointer well here it is again and the way they've been playing that was always going to happen they've certainly been piling on the pressure here Position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Oh, surely. Well, just went a bit too early. Offside. El Ghazi. The keeper diving magnificently to make sure he got there. Salah. Options in the middle. Gives it a go. And a fantastic diving save. Roberto Firmino. Could be. Was he made for moments like this? On an occasion like this? Well, here's the replay, and you just have to admire the patience of the passing as they look for that defence splitting ball, while the movement in the box is equal to it. It's such good timing. What a goal. Again, this looks interesting. Cutting the ball back, and there it is. They take command in the final, and just look at the celebrations here. 
Well, let's look at this again. He's done superbly well to pick out a teammate here. And the finish is clinical. Hitting it cleanly beyond the keeper. That's a good goal. Well, it's been a fairly even match, but at key moments, they've just been second best. They could have defended better for the goals, and they've missed opportunities at the other end. It'll now, be... hold on, Stuart. They're in here. It's gone in beyond the goalkeeper, and Liverpool are level. Well, here it is again. The through ball is absolutely inch perfect. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Naby Keita. This looks threatening. Oh, yes! The goal that might well be decisive. The goal that could give them the trophy. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a really nice ball to put him through. The vision to set up the chance is outstanding, and the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. Yes, a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. Full marks to the entire team, and now they get the chance to exhale and enjoy. They've been brilliant in this competition, and so have the fans. They've really got behind their team. They've played a big part in this win. Just look at those faces in the crowd. Great stuff. They're really a match made in heaven between players and fans. And these celebrations are going to continue for quite some time. Now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken. Well, these photos will be cherished for years to come, won't they? Certainly ones to show the grandchildren.